Well, greetings, folks. Tommy Jane here. Um, I'm at my desk and getting ready to deal with the troll issue today. <laughs> um, we're going to start by trying to talk to Bud Foster at Channel 2 or Channel 11 or something. Uh, okay, we don't need that open. Let's get shit closed that I don't need. I'm working on that. I need that. This is this no, that's not the search. The search is on the back button here. Um, interesting question. I'm working on answering. Is it true that there was a transgender pharaoh? But we'll get to that some other time. I'm gonna. I'll, I need to start reading some more of my writing because that's one of the reasons my writing is as good as it is. Thank you for those who recognize that and compliment me for it. Um, and, and the ones who who who, who offer uh, um, constructive uh, editing suggestions, <laughs> I appreciate that too. Uh, that always helps. But, uh, one of the things that really helps my writing a lot is to read it out loud when I'm editing it. If it doesn't sound right when you're trying to read it off the paper out loud, it isn't going to sound right in your head when you're reading it. So anyway, that's not what I want to be doing right now. Let's see what else I can close. Um, Jeff Blake's speech, I don't need to be talking about that. Uh, Zionist revisionism, I better bookmark that. Let's make a new folder. And let's make it in uh, let's make it in mobile bookmarks. No. That's not where we want to put it. Let's try this again. Bookmarks bar and ah oh shit, we'll just leave it in the top of the bookmarks bar and put it somewhere later. Um, because we, I want to close down as many uh, revision of Zionism, a wiki we don't need open. Um, we don't need that open. Don't need that open. That's garbage.
Well, what do you know? Phone's ringing from a restricted line. Is it somebody that I want to hear from, or is it one of the trolls? Good morning or good afternoon. Hello. Hello. Hi, uh, this is Detective Hoffman with Tucson P. I'm trying to reach uh, Thomas Wassenberg. Oh, that's me. Thank you for calling, and please call me Tommy. Tommy, okay. Um, Tommy, um, uh, Captain Duffy from the uh, West Side uh, Substation. Ah, uh, yeah. Uh, Thank you. Yeah, got the message and asked me to, to uh, return your call for her. I appreciate that. How may I help you? Uh, what was your name again, please? Detective Hoffman. Detective Hoffman. Um, yes. Great. Um, my camera is running. It was running when the phone rang. I was getting ready to do some calls on this subject. Okay. Um, have you read the reports? I have. Have you discussed this with Matthew Golden or Jason Linsky? I have not. You probably should. Okay. Um, what is your What is your feeling about what you've seen so far? Um, well, I, I called the number um, that you had left with Sergeant De La Osa for Glarius by a lark in China. Mm -hmm. And it came back to a Google voice message. Um, but nobody answered. Right. Um, I also Googled the name, and there's actually Google said there's no documents that uh, match that name. Yeah, there's a bunch of names they're using besides that one. There's one, Heaven Kaufman. There's a business name that uh, I just sent a new batch of stuff. They've, they've got like 10 channels at YouTube ripping off my media and adulterating it and then reposting it. Um, and and I can't sue you know YouTube YouTube won't take it down it won't let it stay down if you don't sue and I can't afford to which is why I've been pressing on the police to look at it as a criminal thing this is the criminal fraud they're making they're stealing from me and making money with it yeah, I, I don't know anything about that um, I, I don't know how that would work um, have you have you thought about just because uh, I know that a lot of attorneys will give you the first consultation free. I've had plenty of consultations with attorneys for free. That's why I'm on this track right now. I need to okay. get the police to act on it as a criminal matter. Well, or I need to go into court in pro se and sue the hosts and the police for not acting on it and and uh, plead for a assignment of attorney. Well, I, I, Tommy, I don't mean to... Uh, I'm not saying this to brush you off, but I don't know what we can do um, because that is in the public domain. So I'd have to talk to an attorney about that uh, at the prosecutor's office because I'm not aware of any. I wish you would. Ever. I'm sorry? I said I, I wish you would, please. Okay. Um, what I can do is I will call the prosecutor's office and I will uh, ask them for a little insight on this because I'm not familiar with ever. Typically, because those kind of things, you know, being in the public domain and online and so on and YouTube, et cetera, um, are normally cases that are hand, I mean, they're civil cases. Right. I, on the intellectual property dispute. But right. the use of it is what they're doing is criminal. And that's where the difficulty is. Uh, like with the fads, for instance, they won't touch it because it's way beneath their financial thresholds and, 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 and uh, physical harm. You guys, you guys can't touch it because of the jurisdiction problems. You, where are these people? They're not in well, Tucson. Yeah, I, I don't know that. And, and that would be, um, in fact, I was just going to bring up that point. Um, whether or not they, and, and I don't even know what the state charges would be. I mean, it, it might be. Uh, 132916, I think, is the number. Harassment by uh, uh, electronic means is one. 132916. Yeah. Did you say 14? Let me let me get it. Let me find the bookmark. Let me get off that tab so I don't ruin what I'm working on. Okay. Uh, here it is. 132916. Okay, let me look uh, there with me. Well, that's definitely what the telephone and uh, forum postings uh are violating you know they they're 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 claiming to stand on free speech and fair use and what they're doing ain't free speech or fair use they, they're they're over the boundaries um yeah I, i'm not familiar i've never had anything like that so i, I 
Um, well, it generally gets it, 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 it generally it generally gets it generally gets shuffled off to what the trolls call tar wranglers. That's why you need to talk to Winsky and Winsky and uh, 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 Golden about it. It's that you know it's just SOP when somebody's bringing a complaint like this to the internet is ditch them off on the mental health unit. Um, yeah, I, I don't I don't know anything about the um, your your. Uh, well, that's who's got the records. I mean, this has been going on. It started. It start. I brought it here with me. I'm a I'm a transgender hippie, Jewish transgender hippie. Okay. <laughs> and, and, and one of the kids that was like on the wrong side of the power shift at, after the November twenty second coup. Uh, which one? The, the November twenty second coup. You know the DV deal. That's the one where they splashed John Kennedy's brains all over his old lady's pink Chanel suit, and and, and 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 passed it off on the idiot who couldn't shoot straight. Um, I I come from the military industrial family. We're the builders, not the destroyers. Yeah. Um. Okay. Um. I don't. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm not ignoring you. I'm trying to read through the statute. No, I'm, I'm, I'm with you. You're, 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 you're in the lead on this dialogue, of, of Detective Hoffman, for sure. I mean, I'm really grateful that somebody's finally like looking at this as a real issue. Okay. What, um, now, what are some of the? I know in the report, um, and like get back into that screen. Uh, one of the. It's funny that your name is Hoffman because uh, one the uh, a major player in this game is some is a fictitious character by the name of Kevin Hoffman. Oh, okay. And 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 and, and this glorious Bork and Skya is publishing my uh, my music uh, under the name Heaven Kaufman. Oh, okay. Play on that. Um, you know, between between Golden's notes and what I what I'll send you as soon as you give me an email address, um, there's plenty for you to do if you're really going to investigate this. Well, I mean, it'll be it's not going to be up to me. It's going to be up to the county attorney's office. But um, that uh, actually, the city attorney's because the charge well, well, uh, while well, there's felonies there, you'll find felonies. I assure you. Right, but in the, the statute itself, the one that you referenced is... Uh-huh. Well, you'll find other statutes. You're going to, yeah. you know, and, and there's evidence, I can show evidence of computer intrusion, which is 18, yeah. 10, I think, or 10, 10, 30, I forget which. I always confuse it with a Microsoft code. Um, okay. Uh, I, I, there's only, it sounds like you have a lot more information that I can take over the phone. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> can you... Is there, is there a chance that you could, you know, Not really. Salary? Huh? I, I ha yeah, I have, I have that all ready to fly, man. I've been waiting for somebody to actually pick it up and take it. You know, the old saying says that you know, a person who represents himself in court has a fool for an attorney. Yeah. Um, but if you, if you could, um, it just... Give me a place to send it, and it's on its way, man. It's ready to send you. The summary okay. is here's the summary. I'm a targeted okay. individual. Okay, because that way I can bring it to the county attorney's office. Yeah, here's 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 my allegation. The conspiracy formed uh, to where I could detect it on January twenty or about January twenty first, nineteen ninety nine. As I said, I'm a transgender Jewish hippie who's been part of the resistance since the November 22nd coup. Okay. Um, I've been harassed by trolls constantly. They used to call me ter Tommy the Terrorist on, on, on the AOL forums because I was a truth bomber. And uh, I still do that. Uh, so I've got, like, you know, the extremists on both, on both wings have me targeted. Uh, I can I can hardly keep an account open anywhere. I'm I'm, I'm banned at block I'm blocked at Facebook right now uh, because of them. Um, uh, I get blocked at Quora because of it. I've been kicked off of boards because of it. Uh, they brag about chasing me around. 
Um, there's uh, two individuals who do business with the federal government uh, defense department, uh, one by the name of Thomas Butler, uh, who works actually for the government, supposedly, in the Department of Defense, and another one named Tom Madera, who is the COO of an IT security consulting firm called Spiros. Spiros Consulting out of Bethesda, Maryland, and he's in uh, Omaha uh, area. Uh, what the hell name is, it? is that town? I forget the town right off the top of my head right now. Bellevue. Um, these guys are the ringleaders of these troll sites. The two troll sites, I'll give you, they'll have the link to the two troll sites that I'm sending you, uh, and, and links to all the channels that are uh, hosting my, my uh, media. And there's stuff all over the web, too, that I haven't compiled uh, locations that got it. No, I think I've given you plenty for you to go with, and, you know, you, I think we're on the same page. Would you do Absolutely. Thank you. God bless you. And 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 and, and give my appreciation to Captain Duffy. I was I was getting ready after I called the TV station to talk to them. I was getting ready to go to go to uh, Lisa in the chief's office and say, Hey, look, I started out with Sergeant Delosa, went up to Lieutenant Turner and Captain Duffy, and no response. And I got to know because I need emergency TROs because these people are threatening to come and disrupt my show in February. It's all in writing already, ready to send you, man. Would you mail it to the, the uh, radio substation, which is 1310? I don't want to mail it. I'll either hand deliver it or send it by email. Um, I'd rather really, you we got a copy from your hand. I mean, not, not that you have to deliver it. I mean, if, if It'll be hand delivered tomorrow. Okay. Um, and then uh, just if you leave it at the front desk, I'll make sure they get it to me. And then I will... Uh, we're going to wait and you know, hand it to some, to an investigator. I ain't leaving it at the desk. Oh, okay, well, nobody's going to be... Or I'm not going to be in the office tomorrow. Um, I won't be back until Monday. We can receive it then. I, I want to give it to some... Maybe the captain's, the captain's adjutant or something. I, wanna, I don't want to just leave it at the well, desk. There's going to be an officer at the front desk to take it. It's going to be a commissioned officer. Okay. So, yeah, so, if, okay. And, and, uh, can't... It, you know... Uh, I mean, I can bring it today if I can drop it at the headquarters. I don't know why the hell you moved my my address out of downtown district. I, I have no idea what happened there. Well, because all of the detectives now have been, are housed in the, at the West Side substation. Because the downtown district is um, actually part of the, uh, the West Side substation. The, the West Side Command is, 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 is what's, you know, the, 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 you're saying the headquarters is the headquarters and it's really not, it has nothing to do with uh, the actual street operations. Right, right. I mean, there, yeah, there are four divisions around the city and, and uh, we're in one of them here. And, um, gotcha. and uh, the headquarters is, is mostly like uh, the central um, investigative units like robbery and homicide and that sort of thing. Gotcha. Okay. okay. Great. Thank you. I'll be looking Th thank you that. so much, and uh, you know, thank thank Captain Duffy for like lightning, okay, well, lightning, well, lightning you off. Happy day, man. Bye bye. Okay. Bye. Okay. I guess that what we need to do is that changes our our attitude toward uh, the the TV. Let's see if I can get Bud on the phone. Bud Foster is the anchor, and he's been here forever for CBS. Um, okay, which one's KOLD? KOLD must be the CBS station. There it is.
Well, be chemist B, can you? Hi. What's the chances of getting Bud Foster on the phone? Um, I don't know, but uh, I can just transfer to his extension. One moment. Okay, thanks. Hi, Bud. This is Tommy Tudor. We met downtown um, several times. I'm um, the, the horn player, the hippie horn player. Um, I've been wanting to get together with you and uh, discuss organized cybercrime and cyberbullying and the targeting of dissident artists and um, uh, artists and educators in the social networks by uh, professional trolls. And, um, you know, it's something that's very difficult to get any prosecution on and almost impossible to get civil litigation done without, you know, spending huge amounts of money, which I don't have. Oh, uh, and none of the other co-plaintiffs that I have, um, have it. Um, the hot tip is that uh, I just got off the phone with a Detective Hoffman who is investigating complaint number 1712240223 and one seven one two one zero zero three four zero and where the discussion is between me and him right now is I need to get together a summary of what's going on and deliver it to him and then uh, um, he'll talk to the city attorney about it um, and I'd like to talk with you guys about possibly doing a story about it because it's a nationwide issue uh, with a uh, site called Kiwi Farms that's targeting all the transgender activists. There have been at least two suicides and numerous attempts because of it. Um, they've been on me for two years. So um, hopefully uh, somebody will get back to me on this, man. Happy day. 520-241-2776. Uh, Thanks for listening. To make private, press 1. To make priority, press 2. Priority. To make private, press 1. To remove priority status, press 2. To include a fax, press 5. To send, press pound. Thank you for leaving your message. To access your mailbox, press stop. Okay, we'll kill that. Ah, oh, so... I might as well, since that's taking, that's nice. That's like, a, oh boy, is that a huge load. Fuck them. <laughs> what, what, fuck them. 23 minutes, let's go fuck with their heads a little bit. <laughs> Cow, well, this has been going on for 15, 17, 18 years. Um, you know, my first, my first police complaint about the internet was in January 1999. There's a, there's a, the paper trail. The shit doesn't go away. You, you do it, and it's, it, it's saved forever somewhere. Okay, who do we want to fuck with first? Let's see what's anything in the mail. Oh, I was, yeah, I was responding to Garrick. Um, about <laughs> Here's extra duck sauce, Glarious Blorkin Sky, Heaven Kaufman, whatever the fuck the person's real name is. I've spoken at length, or, or however many people there are involved in this, I've spoken at length with Garrett Martin, Adam, and a whole assortment of Rainbow family members. They all know Tom as a retarded pedo. There's no old family versus new family like Tom Spurg's about. He's not invited to any gathering because even for hippies, he fucking smells and he doesn't get along with people and is constantly screeching about nothing. He is alone. <laughs>
I think it's time. <laughs>
Ja. Okay, so here's my response to Garrick, who, you know, let's back up because it's been a while since I said anything. Uh, Garrick, I sent Garrick uh, the boast from uh, Axe of Duck Sauce. Yeah, so here's here's the th here, I said I sent this uh, to Garrick uh, on the seventeenth. This is it is to let you know that like uh, I'm alone and isolated. Um, and I, I I said to him then, and so I'm sure this isn't true, but even if it isn't, it is confirmed that Adam is talking about me this way all over the place. What are you going to do about that besides stroke me with some bullshit like you've been doing straight along on this? There is going to be legal action, and there aren't many people who can speak for the Rainbow Family in the civil action against it. 
which was a really nice, good, solid, backhanded way of uh, threatening him with, you know, with being the one on the, on the, on the, on the docket. So his, his response is, who is writing this? I never, in caps, referred to or discussed you as anything like that with anyone. Absolutely. Who is extra D anyway? So the answer to that is, I'm sure if you check with Plunk or any of the others, they will tell you that they've never failed, they've never talked to anybody like that about me. Somebody once contacted AJ Weberman, somebody contacted AJ Weberman about me once and he just blew them off. The rumor mongers are Gary Purdue, Marty, and Stubbs. Purdue posts at both another messageboard.com and kiwifarms.net and is the one inciting against me in the Facebook groups. Stubbs is just a mean old asshole control freak, happy to spread lies. <laughs> Marty got pissed when I went public with a confirmed rumor of spousal abuse and abandonment of the child of his ex before his current mate, and made up the story about raping a kid in, in Pennsylvania and getting banned forever. Whoops. See, this is why you read it out loud. You spot errors like, like I just spotted. Extra word. Pete Golden, a.k.a. Sorry Needle, is a friend of the ex. Marty himself has told me about getting healed from being a multiple substance abusing drunk to a multiple substance abusing acid guru who fires, finances guru gatherings with drug sales. Strong rumors of meth cooking coming out from his land as well as Shantasina training camps. Nobody ever took the hippies being Hopi shtick seriously. <laughs> Chaver, we'll call him Chaver here. <laughs> That's Hebrew for friend. The North American Council has always been dominated by drug dealers and their New Age fake lore peddling clientele like Plunker, Magi, Rainbow Hawk, and so many other high, holy, hypocritical sexual predators. Can you protect yourself from that revelation when the truth becomes known? I can, despite the accusations that I am one also. David Williams can, Greg Blanchard can, Joaquin can, Felipe Chavez can, Joe Villalobos can. not I don't know about Mike Cardinal or Dave Fidley, but my guess is they can. I'm sure Sanity is going to be able to walk away clean from that reality when the time comes. Extra Dust Sauce is just an alias from, for some sadomasochistic, sociopathic, psychophantic sexual deviant in my anti-fan club. You know the term toxic masculinity? That's this dump. It's owned by a 20 nothing alt-right pervert with a tranny fetish. Fascist furries of all things. Google it. It's an eye popper. Our show runs from the 26th to the 10th. The shop is going to be lit up here the whole time. 7-Eleven, a young deadhead digger, is bringing a couple of machines and some wire wrappers with him. I'd like to do an event like we did last year, but actually have some guests. Ariana is working on the advertising right now. A four-hour evening block for us to host a family jam and jam in the middle of the show would be way cool. Pencil in whatever works your calendar, and I'll make it happen from here. You want to try to make the Top Dead Center show with David Gans. GD family is all going to be there. I don't know the date yet. Happy day, peace, Tommy Jane. I've been doing this. Uh, since 1973, I think it was, um, with a Motorola. Is that where it was? Yeah, that's where the fuck it was. It was 1973, I had a little Motorola word processing machine. It was a typewriter with a screen. Got it. Got it used at a thrift store, I think. Or I was, it was my first apartment, and I was shopping at the thrift store, and there it was. For about, like, 20 bucks or something. Okay, here's and, and, and I sent this out to the here's here's ha 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 ha. Um.
boxes. <laughs> okay, that was TBAKL telling me to eat a dick. BRB man. <laughs> Gotta refill the mug. go out and make some money sometimes back. I'm so fucking broke I can't even pay attention. Um okay that's all taken care of. Don't miss a connection. I have an invitation in, uh, expiring soon. Invitation to do what? Who's the break? Receiving clerk at temp Tempe camera repair. Oh, this is probably that dude. That's probably this is probably the guy that uh, came and bought that toolbox from me. That was interested in a uh, one of the uh, furnace. Uh, not why well, he was interested in the furnace. And all the all the antique dental tools. He wanted to see all of it because they're like he's involved with a museum. Um, we'll get to that later. Hmm. This is this is this is this is this is this is like this is troll busting. Well, nothing going on there. Oh yeah, I was in the middle of answering a cool question. Um, we don't need to. Well, I, I suppose I could stay logged in. <laughs> this, this, this place, it, 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 Satya Nadella. Well, I probably should follow the the CEO of of Microsoft. Let's see who else they want me to follow. American Quilter Society, Terran Art Gallery. That's a follow for me. Arts to Crafts, <laughs> Web RTC. What the hell is RTC? I'll have to look that up. Windows Topic. That's always. I should probably keep an eye on that. Hire an illustrator. Printing. You know, I, you know, it's, this is this is what social networking is about: is you follow the people that are doing the same shit you're doing, or sim, you know, things that are re related. But I'm not interested in any of this crap. Art marketing. <laughs> I'm an art marketer. Randy Zuckerberg. Zuckerberg Media. <laughs> Is that his sister or something? Another 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 branch of the Rothschilds. <laughs> Justin Trudeau. I want to say out of that shit. I got, I got, I have Canadian friends that keep me. You know, I, I'm, a, I'm an American Gonzo, and I have Canadian Gonzos to tell me what I want to know about Canada's politics and shit. Angel investor. Well, we could use one of those. <laughs> This guy's probably good for a few laughs too. Simon Sinek, optimist and founder at Start With Why. Now I'm going to just become a reader. <laughs> Jeff Wiener. Oh boy, LinkedIn is owned by a Wiener. Let's follow Jeff. Um, 
Towel Road Gay News. That's probably going to have some good shit. <laughs> uh, wireless communications topic. I probably should keep an eye on that. Eduardo Saverin, co-founder of Facebook Incorporated. You know, you know. <laughs> kind of, kind of third dummy. <laughs> I wonder if Paul Allen's going to be in here. <laughs> like I, I was, I was following him through that kind of shit in, you know, in the or in the early uh ohs. Um. I really don't need Ariana in my in my feed here. <laughs> Ariana Huffington, that is. Um, Richard Branson. Now he's 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 like a hot tip. I know that name. And when I I just need to just like be putting my shit out here, at, you know, our professional stuff here, at uh, at LinkedIn. Just fuck Facebook. Bunch of it's just a bunch of criminals um, harassing people who are trying to make a living, or just trying to be you know have fun, or trying to make a point politically. Tech launch Arizona, but I'm not a tech launch. <laughs> We're arts and crafts. <laughs> Flying Arts Alliance, yes. <laughs> um, Association of Women Art Dealers, yes. You know, when, when they say art, art singular, it's always like painting, graphic art. And, you know, lapidary art is just like way off to the side of all that. Um, but it's best-selling art. <laughs> it sells the easiest with any art. That's why I got into it. And, and and it's you know it's easy to transport. I can I can pack up fifty thousand dollars worth of it into one bag. <laughs> everybody loves it. Some, some everybody loves bright shiny things. And, and, and it's fun to work with and it's nice people in in, the, in the trade shows and fairs. That's an important one. Um, might as well follow small business. Um. Fuck feminism. I don't want to get into it. I'm not getting into any feminist discussions here. Huh? <laughs> Guess they're getting banned from LinkedIn? No. Um, I'm not interested in feminism. Not in fundraising. This, this, and affiliate marketing? Yes. <laughs> Mindfulness is a nice topic to follow. Creativity is always good for a few laughs. Okay, I think we're set up with plenty of things to follow. <laughs> and I probably should share some stuff. Uh, I, I wanted to, I, yeah, this is a troll, this is a troll video. How, how long is it? So, oh, we're already an hour into it. Um, yeah, I don't want to do that. On a, I, I don't want to, I don't want to, no, I really don't want to expose my LinkedIn to them too much. There are some people I can't even mention their names. Prominent, prominent activists who have to like keep their children under wraps, or you know, the you know horrible. On both coasts, there was transgender murder, and both both instances, one of them's confirmed to be, and the other one they're still they're still waiting for the determination. One of them was definitely um, she was killed by her spouse. The other one seems to have been killed by an acquaintance that uh, was that was over a disagreement. Um, so that's that's like in the air because it's you know people are politicizing it and rightfully so, um, but it doesn't fit the circumstance in either one of these cases. <coughs> Yeah, um,
Uh, what else? My my nose spray. I'm I'm having I'm having some trouble breathing today, and it's not my lungs. It's my nose and my my throat. Ears, nose, and throat. My ears are clear. But I guess that dry, you know, what comes in my ears causes a lot of mucus everywhere else. Oh, fucking noise pollution comes into my body. That's all I've been this way. I, you know, I, I, I end up coughing and sneezing and runny nose. And my lungs are strong. That's not, that's not a COPD cough you're hearing. Um, well, the fuck, where to go? Okay, yeah, this is a troll video. This is one of long ones. Hey, fuck you, boys. <laughs> uh, so let's go. Let's go take a look at the kiwi farms first. Well, let's see what my rank is today. <laughs> Here's the target. Let's read off the targeted individuals at Kiwi Farms. We have Carl Benjamin slash Sargon of ACAD. Well, this is probably a gamer. Archivist Bex, eight, aka 8 Bit Bach, Becca, Remembrancer MX, Bex Gerber, Rebecca Maria Hernandez Gerber, Parasitic, Narcissistic, BBT, BPD Autist, Fake Jew, and Tranny, Self Described Genius Phony. I probably should take a look at that one. That's she's 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 labeled a drama cow. Um, she's this is number one and two. Uh, number three is Russell Greer, the Swift obsessed sex pest. Um, then we have Bob Movie Chipman, an obese fascist pop culture critic with a Mario fetish, leading us to a superior future. Brian Henderson, A.K.A. Catherine Gray, Katie Keys. They like they like transgender people. Troon, treating, teaching about orgasms, pregnancy, and trying to time travel. <laughs> okay, I hope I probably should look at that one too because this is this is these are the kind of people that are driving to suicide. Back pocket game reviews. Nicholas Hill, BPGR, False Jesus, nineteen eighty seven. False Jesus has over 50, 50 videos about GameStop. CPS visits him regularly. Old lady took his couch. Andrew Dobson, aka. Tom Preston, stop doing sexist crap. The spoony one, that doesn't say it's Boogie, Susan Schofield, and Michael Schofield of Schofield Productions, abuses and drugs her kids, poster family for exploiting mentally ill children. Hmm, better take a look at that one too sometime. Uh, Brian Walker Wu, John Walker Flint, that's one of the gamers. Dave Daniel Moscato, atheism activist, and Bernie Bro. They're, they're, see, it's an alt right crowd. Uh, Jake Logan, Jake Paul, and Logan Paul, uh, YouTuber, Vine, that's gamer. Expert doctor, uh, that's, that's troll on troll shit. Will Wheaton, Felicia Day, shut up, Wesley's. Gabriel, um, well, I'm falling down in the ratings. I'm already halfway down the first page. My, my, my thing shoots up to the top. When 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 I post post these videos, <laughs> uh, and I think they they think they have me ass mad and and fear sharding and <laughs> I don't even want to read that shit. You want to go go look at it? I don't give a fuck. I ain't reading it uh, unless it's really extremely stupid. Um. Okay, moving on down the line, we have T.J. Church. Uh, uh, Gabriel, Gabby Rivera, Quirky, Quirky Rican, uh, racist, failed writer, lesbian propagandist. T.J. Church, failed literatica writer and or Noll's best friend. Noll is the, the site owner. Joshua Connor Moon, who uh, I don't even want to go into the, the history of this shit. But we do have an investigator. The case has been has been has been assigned to at least take to the city attorney for approval to prosecute. Brad Watson, 
uh, Jesus and Albert Einstein reincarnated, discover of God equals seven underscore, uh, seven underscore four theory. Kurt Eichenwald, Roy Rogers, Andrew McDonald, epileptic loser that a logs Republican, suspected pedo, jerks off to anime, sexist, racist, two chaps. Uh, Evo Zephon, um, is apparently another transgender person. Developer of Yandere Simulator and with the face only a mother could love. There's a lot of a lot of effeminate man who may or may not be um, like have physical um, I don't know. There's a lot of a lot of transgender a lot of transgender people, a lot, a lot of geeks uh, decide they want to be women. Um, and you know what what the uh, psychology behind that, or the physiology behind that, is I don't even want to speculate at this time. Um, there, that's what this whole site is based on. One, uh, Chris Chandler, uh, who is the uh, author of something called Sonichu, which is some kind of silly anime game. Um, and uh, it's the the site's dedicated to studying him or her. Um, Bam. Uh, so moving on down the line. Yeah, we don't need to read them all. Okay, I'm I'm almost down to the bottom. Nope, I'm in. Uh, yeah, I'm I'm in the bottom quarter of the page of the front page. I'm 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 a highly favored lol cow. So let's go to the back page. The last, the last commenter was Chan the Wizard, um, at, uh, <laughs> yeah, no, these people are, like, totally insane. I ain't gonna read this shit. That's just stupid shit. That's just stupid shit. They're going off on my, on my, on my, uh, on the videos they've stolen of me and then reposted. Okay, let's go see what's going on with the AM Beasts. Can be arranged.
that. Thank you for finally seeing it. What were we doing? Oh yeah.
хочу. Okay, and here's what uh, Max Power. Here's here's the, the we'll we'll read we'll read this whole fucking thread. This is fucking ridiculous. This is this is the kind of ridiculous shit these guys do. And mostly, you know, I never even had was seriously considering suing any of them for any of this shit because it's a private board where people are being assholes to be assholes for fun. And I've gone way over the boundaries of free speech myself there. Um, this is that Jimmy Webster character who calls himself Dr. Hugh G. Rection. Um, the question he asked is, did Seven give Tommy AIDS? Words on the street is that Tom is HIV positive now, thanks to a rough rogering by Seven, who has to AIDS to lol. Seven is a horny dude. He sure buggered Tom good. Um, here's a picture of hearing AIDS. <laughs> So we'll give him a chuckle. <laughs> that was not as funny. And right, so here's 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 douchebag. Uh, Max Power, a.k.a. Addie Claret, until I see proof that Tommy didn't beg Seven to come deep in his throat after anally violating his anus, I have no reason not to believe it happened. I have no reason to even think like that. <laughs> Much less do it. Uh, especially not with a kid like Seven. I mean, I might do it for big money. No, anus, no anus violation, sorry. I mean, I was concerned for years, you know, as part of my stick was, yeah, I'd do it for a million dollars in uh, gold or precious gems, but, and, and you'd ha your dick would have to be smaller than the average turd. Um, but I, I, I thought about that, it's like, no, <laughs> no, I'll suck a dick. I, I, I don't probably suck at a dick. I just look at it as therapy. <laughs> not, and not for me, for, you know, it's pity head. <laughs> Uh, well, I ain't taking one up the pooper, no. <laughs> Not for anything. No, sorry. I mean, and you'll have to kill me to get it in there. Um, if you try to rape me. Uh, so anyway, my, my answer is, I think a meeting between you, me, him, and a whole mess of diggers could be arranged sometime in the near future. I've had absolutely no sexual relations of any kind for over 20 years, not even jacking off a female dog. Seven is very romantic, very heterosexual, and married man who just built a house for his wife in Montana. You are now all subjects of an investigation Captain Duffy ordered all open. The detective is taking my evidence to the city attorney for prosecution of at least Arizona 13-29-16. I will not be filing anywhere, anything anywhere until after the gem shows as I stated originally. The police chose to act. Now it's in the city attorney's court, but at least the police are watching for any invasion of my privacy in person. Um, and I think I'll call Ariana real quick and put her on notice about, find out when she can get, we need to go over to the, Hi. Uh, camera's running. Uh, the camera is running right now, just so you know. <laughs> and it can okay. hear it. Well, I probably should take, I'm going to take you off speaker, I think. 
let's turn the speaker off. Um, the cops open an investigation. Okay, but I need to get on on the threat. All of it. The whole thing together. Um, there was one. That, well, yeah. There, well, I've got it all organized, and you know, I, I'd already, I'd already transmitted some of it to the legal department at uh, YouTube about the channels. Um, I think, I think I, 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 I copied you and anything, anything of like um, serious nature like that is going to get blind BCC to you and you and Jenny. Uh, yeah, any, anything like yeah, any, any, any emails I send like that that are like you know serious legal shit. You and Jenny are my witnesses. Well, you're 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 my closest friends. That's okay. That's just you know yeah right. That's the point. Exactly. Uh, but we need to get over to the cop shop. I know you're busy. You're a busy little bee. And, What? Yeah, that's just a yeah. This is a, this is an FYI. <laughs> and and you're you're my witnesses. You're my closest friends. You know I'm being threatened. I just need to round it all up and put it on a put it on a on a on a flash drive and bring it over there, or or a CD. Oh no, I've got everything pretty much. Or I just need I just need to compile it. I just need to. I just need to compile. I saw it. You know, there, there's probably about I don't know how many files. I just need to to, to conjugate. Um, we uh, and that won't take me long. Um, but I need to get over to that cop shop over in Miracle Mile at, at your first earliest convenience. Ah, uh, not even later. Uh huh. I'm not gonna. I'm not bussing over there. It's two buses. Fuck that. I'm not. I'm not gonna worry about it. I'm not gonna worry about it. I have it. I have him set up for tomorrow. I just today it'd be nice because he's on duty. He's not gonna be there tomorrow. It's okay, you know, just as long as I know, you know, the only thing that's of any urgency is that uh, they're on alert about the threat for the show. Right, and I think that's the right, uh, yeah. Yeah, there, there isn't going to be, and if there is, it's going gonna, it's gonna to get quelled quickly because the, the security people are all off-duty cops. And, and our booth is going to be teeming with fucking diggers, family diggers. So, there's, there, you know, some, some fucking idiots from the internet are not going to get in my face with a camera and start harassing me. Do they call you Brian or Mr. Sykes? They they do that to me. Right. Well, there's a lot of people who hang out with me. <laughs> they think they think that I'm just like this like really creepy creature that like is always in my room and, and or or dumpster diving. That's the only thing they see me doing. Is, is screaming at them on the internet and dumpster diving. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. 
Well, it's the the corporation, you know, anything they that they, you know, this millennial turkey thing is not. The corporation is called Lal Kal LLC. Yeah, it's yeah, it's this alt right. It's this lot, you know. Have you ever heard of Christine? Have you ever heard of a uh, Christine uh, Chandler? That's the person who. Yeah, that's the person that started the whole thing. It's this Chris Chandler was a, a game developer, is a game developer. Yeah, okay. Yeah, it's totally, totally a bunch of fetishes. It's fascist furries. It's nuts. It's totally nuts. <laughs> and all right, you know, it's like, what the fuck? <laughs> what is wrong with you people? <laughs> uh, That, they, they they can't they 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 have you know the I I think I see them talking getting on somebody about the kind of stuff you do and it's, it's, they, they can't they got no, they got nothing to stand on because they do it themselves or worse. Exactly, and, you know, and and grown up grown up uh, queers. Um, talk about it in that way, you know. Uh, especially, especially the ones that uh, are on the edge of the industry. You know, people like myself who've watched it all my life, for instance. Well, I'll check it out. Right. So that's the. Well, I don't think YouTube has any any uh, any, any 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 rules against that. Um, they don't require you to. I, they do require you to give them real information if you're monetizing a channel, though. Yeah, so you know they got you. That's what did you read? Did you read the uh, did you read the DMCA letter carefully? I mean, it, it's kind of hard to read because of all the previews. I should have turned off the previews and just left them as links. Um, but what it comes down to, well, just scroll through it. Just scroll past the links because the body of the letter is actually past the links. Um, Well, did you see what it, what the what the form? The, uh, it was I, I I modified a form, and there's a couple of paragraphs in there that are like several paragraphs. There's three paragraphs that follow all the links. It's really the meat of the complaint. Yeah, just scroll past the links and look for where I signed it, because that's where the meat of the complaint is. Is after the links. It's after the links. And before that whole big string of shit from A and B. Um, and and what it is is, um, YouTube's exempt from copyright infringement problems if they like respond. I mean, just they have a general blanket exception exemption of some kind. Um, if as, so long as they respond in a timely fashion to. Uh, Infringement complaints. If they don't, then they're they're liable when when the, when the suit comes down, and they lose their they lose their they lose their immunity, in general. So it's the the whole thing's in their lap, and it was assigned this morning, and uh, they're taking it to the city attorney um, on uh, the electronic harassment, at least. You know that's why I got to get everything in order and you know coherent is is John Trudell's uh, buzzword on, <laughs> on on delivery of like you know um, sensational information. That's how coherent how coherently can you do it? 
So you're totally unavailable until in the morning? Can we get an early start? I mean, I've wasted a lot of time over that fucking... I, I finally had to run them off this morning. I mean, I, it was like, can I take this hour? No, go. You can come back. You can come back when you're a whole person with your wife. You're just too much of a drain. He's too much, he was too much of a drain. I mean, he's doing the bare minimum to... Well, no, he, he, well, because he's a fucking, he's a fucking stoner. He's a fucking bliss ninny. Um, he's, he, yeah, you, you know, there's 24 hours in a day, and I was requiring one hour of labor, and that's all he was giving me. Well, that's okay, you know, you put, you put some money, you know, when it comes, when we get our ducks in a row to start the, start the, uh, you, you think about how much you're willing to risk or just put off in a savings account that we're going to, we're going to use for credit rather than, we're not going to be touching the principal. You, you understand that. We are, we're going to not be touching the print, we are not going to be touching the principal on the account. You will be the principal signator on the account. How much money do you want to put in there? You come out of it with 25% of real things. That's 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 what's going on with the with the business account. You just you just you just own the business account, and we'll use it as credit. That's a, you know, it's a credit union. We don't have to touch that principal. That's your savings account. The business checking account would become your savings account. You're in control of it. We don't touch the principal at all. I don't want anything to do with the money. I don't want anything to do with the money. The less I have to think, the less I think I, I have to think, yeah, well, let's let the bank handle the fucking money then. <laughs> okay? That's what they're there for. Uh, the less I have to think about money, the more money I generate. Okay? The less of that shit that lands in my pocket that I have to think about what to do with it, the more money comes in for everybody. I'm the one I'm the one that knows where to spend the money, but I don't want to have to handle it until it's time to do that. Well, consider it your investment in the business. That's your capital in the business that we're working on. And it's 25% of the business if you do it with at least $200. Just giving us that credit is worth 25% of it. And, and, your, and your wheels. And, and, and the labor that you do is 25% of my action. 200 200 yeah, two hundred bucks, two hundred bucks in the bank, uh, at least, and and it's twenty five percent of my action, and we'll put it all on paper properly for the show. I yeah, that's that's you know I got distracted from that by the by the urgency of doing the troll thing, but now the cops are on it, so I can get back to that kind of stuff. Super. Love you, babe. Bye-bye. Okie dokie. Namaste, motherfuckers. <laughs> Let's see what the idiots have got to say now. <laughs> Let's see what the idiots are saying. Yeah, I'm at my desk. This is It's it's 2.41. I, I, I stayed up all night. Um... And then, oh, now what the fuck? This is, he's got a fresh one. And Tommy admitted to statutory rape. Tommy admitted to almost having sex with a minor. Totally consensual. <laughs> he just bumped it. What, what a bozo. So we'll just give him the horsey. <laughs> Is there be that's that's the dead horse they're beating.
Now here's here's an idiot. Oh, don't tell me, my dear irrelevant hobo. Don't forget, they're all paid by us. <laughs> yeah, I don't even want to read that shit. This is vulgar. They're just vulgar. That's all it is. It's, it's like people who, who, who have to be in, in uh, polite company. Um, ha. Yeah, so anyway, I, I, I was up one night. I didn't go to sleep until dawn. Um, after dawn, I don't know. And then the idiot got me up at nine again, and I ran him off. This is stupid, stupid talk. Let's see what this stupid talk is. This is one of my, I suppose, a couple of videos. Of, you know, I went looking for, I was looking for the videos they were doing about me. Um, the time I saw other ones that they were doing about them. <laughs> and, and they're just nuts. They're just, people are just totally fucking insane. Nah, that's just stupid talk. Now here's 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 Addy lying about where he got the email from. Oof. 
This is here, boys. Say this one out loud. Okay, so here's this Ashley Wilkes character who is supposedly like a retired musician who was like a never anybody, just kind of a sideman, I guess. I don't know if that was real or not when they were talking about that shit. So this fool says, in this thread you promise a lawsuit, demand money to make the threatened suit go away, and make that what any reasonable person, this someone not a deranged drug addict, adequate like you, could construe as a death threat. I don't remember what the threat was, but it was like definitely destroying their world with a legal shitstorm. Basically, what I was offering them was uh, license my shit, and I'll, I'll I won't complain about uh, criminal behavior. That's what well, you know. I'm I'm making a criminal complaint against Kiwi Farms, and uh, it's it's going to be against everybody if they don't license my shit. And this has been this has been what I've been telling them for seven years now. No, no. Fuck you. Why, 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 why buy the cow when you can get the milk for free? Well, there's laws in this country, and you are not protected by the First Amendment or fair use. What you're doing is fraud. So my response to him is lots of people take me seriously, but pseudo-intellectual, quasi-literate, semi-sentient sacks of sadomasochistic, sociopathic, septic, sewage sludge like yourselves seem to be slightly impaired in that regard. Would you like me to repeat that? Lots of people take me seriously, but pseudo-intellectual, quasi-literate, semi-sentient sacks of sadomasochistic, sociopathic, septic, sewage sludge like yourselves seem to be slightly impaired in that regard. Should I do it a third time to make sure you guys understand what the fuck you really are? Lots of people take me seriously, but pseudo-intellectual, quasi-literate, semi-sentient sacks of sadomasochistic, sociopathic, septic sewage sludge, like yourselves, seem to be slightly impaired in that regard. Booyah! <laughs> Namaste, motherfuckers. <laughs>
I'm gonna, I just come in on 3 o'clock, and it's a beautiful day today, and fuck this. I've been, my, my feet are starting to get a little bit like saying, hey, um, let's go for, let's go, let's go out and play for a while. Um, try to peddle some jewelry and get people to give me money for making noise. Okay, is there anything I really... Oh, yeah, that's right. There's a fucking potluck this afternoon. Guess who's bringing the garbage? I'm, I'm, bringing, I'm bringing a bottle of pickled mushrooms and, and, and zucchini that I made. And none of it's garbage. I need the mushrooms I bought. Oh, that reminds me. No. <laughs>
We are the dumb deer. <laughs> Yeah, persistence and insistence. You know, if you think you're right, persist and insist, and eventually somebody's gonna go, "Oh, the person's right."
Let's take a look at this and then leave. Uh, looks like there's some stuff down there. Uh Bella. It's just the same old shit. I'm dying with COPD. Um, well, that's screaming at me. I'm not even going to read this for you. Here. There, look at it. Oh, bring it to me, Ashley Wilkes. You know, someday I'm going to see you face to face. And, and I'm going to very calmly emasculate you. Not scream at you like this. That's it! Let the rage flow, little man! Think of all those times Gene tried to beat the gay out of you! Fuck you. I'm not performing for you, you asshole. Dance, Magoo. Keep pounding the fucking keyboards like this. Yeah, I'm out of here. Now they're starting to piss me off. Waste my time. It's 3 o'clock. I'm going to go play. That's bullshit, that's bullshit, this bullshit. Why Tom can't keep friends on Facebook. Let's see who 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 they stop you. Who who'd I dump this time? Oh, this the old that's old news.
jajaja. That's just stupid shit. More stupid shit. I'm out of here. Fuck him. Fuck him. Goodbye. Let's see what's going on in Quora. Merged. My answer was moved. Oh, someone gave me an answer to this. What are the fastest routes? Um.
Well, people like my answer to this question. Why are Abrahamic religions so historically opposed to homosexuality and bisexuality? There are some biblical passages in later commentary putting a taboo on anal sex and same-sex relations that have been exaggerated and misinterpreted over time. Also, it's my theory that this sex, gender, binary, and all the stereotypical behaviors that go with it are a means of controlling the breeding population separated for extended periods because of foreign military exploits. A couple of people like that one. <laughs> uh, have I got any uploads, uh, up, uploads on this one yet? Oh, the irrefutable. Here, this, why do some people refuse to believe I've gotten one upvote for this one. To believe, irre, to believe irrefutable facts. Many concepts that people put forth as facts are invalid and unworthy of debate. For some examples, the earth is flat. The moon landing was a hoax. Climate change is a hoax. There are only two genders. The transgender condition is a mental illness. Transgender people in sp gender specific facilities present a clear and present danger of lewd behavior and sexual assault. Zionism is not a fascist political ideology that violates Hebrew law. The U.S. was not built on slavery and genocide and isn't in reality a plutocratic oligarchy that is running a perpetual war machine with ecologically unsound technology. Donald Trump is not a dangerously malignant racist and sexist narcissist who is entirely unfit for the office of President of the United States. These facts are not facts. Okay. Short rant over. I don't think I don't either. Okay, yeah, it's almost 3.30, and it's going to get cool fast. Not too bad. It's been clear today, so. Um, it's been clear today, so when the sun goes down, it, it, it chills fast. Cloudier day will hold, it, hold the heat down a little longer. So, uh, we've well, we got about three hours of that shit for them to get upset about. <laughs> 2.21. Okay. Uh, you know, it is not legal to copy this video and then take clips from it. I'm sorry. And then especially not make money from it. That's fraud. It's invasion of privacy by misappropriation. It's fraud. And to summarize at the end, for anybody who's really slogged through this, there is an active police investigation that is now being uh, taken to the city attorney for uh, prosecution. Or, you know, pass or play for prosecution. So, uh... 
Put that one in your pipe and smoke it, boys. Happy day. Bye.